Yes, I'm uh, nearby the place when I'm about to leave Patagonia. It's El Amarillo. I'm 100 kilometers from Caleta Gonzalez, where I would just take a ferry and go to Puerto Montt, and this will be end of Patagonia for me. I decided to visit the famous Pumalin Park. I can call it a jungle for the people who are afraid of snakes and spiders. It le really looks like a, a jungle. Check out if it was worth it. I wanted to dry my underpants, so I left them for the night to dry. <laughs> I guess if there is heaven, it must feel like this. I feel healthy, I feel good, and uh, the surroundings, it's... it's it's beautiful, I'm in the park, it's sunny, it's a clear sky, it's no rain, it's a crispy clear air, and somebody cut the grass here. I'm alone, I'm not sure if you're alone in, the, in heaven, but I'm, uh, I'm a long distance cyclist and uh, many times now I'm alone at least in Patagonia so yeah and I mean uh, it's Pumalin Park and I didn't pay for entrance so heaven is clear sky no wind no rain somebody cut the grass and you don't pay for the entrance so I guess and you're healthy this is how it is in heaven this is a long distance cycling cyclist definition of heaven. When you walked yeah. away, it was a saddest day. Never would us know. Shattered my heart and left me with pieces of a broken home. Now you say.
Okay guys, so in my opinion this was a wonderful place and I really had a great time here. I spent here almost one day. I had a camping just for me and now I'm going to El Amarillo and then to Chai Tan to see Chai Tan and uh, Volcan Chai Tan. Uh, I'm not sure how about you but I think like El Amarillo is kind of a place you can call a Switzerland village. It's so nice here. Okay, um, thanks for watching. Thank you and have a good day. Bye.